The power of the universe is immense, vast beyond comprehension, and filled with a seemingly infinite number of mysteries. There is so much going on in the cosmos that, in most cases, we have no idea what is happening. Despite all our advancements, we still find ourselves puzzled by the sheer scale and complexity of the universe. We keep wondering why we exist, why there are planets and stars, and what other possible destinies might have been had the universe evolved differently. Often, we don't pay attention to problems until they become critical, even if they will eventually affect us. One such concern that has recently drawn the eyes of astronomers and scientists around the world is the strange and unsettling behavior of Betelgeuse, also known as Betelgeuse, one of the largest stars in the firmament. This colossal star has begun to show signs of instability, trembling alarmingly, which could indicate that something frightening is happening within its massive structure. This star has long been the subject of study because of its gigantic size. In fact, it is so huge that it makes our sun seem tiny in comparison. It is not a star like other stars and never has been. Betelgeuse is a red supergiant, a classification that puts it among the largest types of stars known to science. And despite its prominent appearance in the night sky, Betelgeuse is actually much more distant than it appears from Earth, more than 640 light years away. Although this distance may not seem significant at first glance, in cosmic terms it is immense. Even if we could travel at the speed of light, which is far beyond our current capabilities, it would still take more than 640 years to reach it. Something impossible with current technology. Under normal conditions, it would take us more than 12 million years to complete such a long journey, an amount of time that is much longer than the entire history of mankind. This gives us a humbling idea of the magnitude and strength of the star, which has been shaking intensely for some time now, captivating astronomers across the globe. Stars, although they appear quiet and motionless from our perspective here on Earth, are in fact not quiet at all. Regardless of their size, they are dynamic, turbulent, and full of activity. Scientists do not yet fully understand the signals that Betelgeuse emits. It has been labeled a pulsating red supergiant for a long time, and its brightness varies in cycles ranging from 10 to hundreds of days, depending on whether it is expanding or contracting. These gradual changes show us how dynamic this star is. Another interesting thing about Betelgeuse is that its brightness varies considerably, ranging from magnitude 5 to magnitude 0, which is a big difference between stars. These variations in brightness occur in cycles. The shortest cycle lasts approximately 185 days, while the longest cycle is a whopping 2,335 days. Occasionally, these changes occur more regularly and can be measured with a great degree of accuracy. For example, in February 2021, the V-band value of Betelgeuse dropped to 1.614, one of the lowest recorded in recent years. This deviated from Betelgeuse's usual brightness, capturing the attention of astronomers who closely monitor such fluctuations. Not only is its brightness remarkable, but also its intense red color, which is due to its surface temperature of about 3,500 Kelvin. This is much lower than the Sun's 5,500 Kelvin. Although the Sun is smaller than Betelgeuse, the latter emits less energy per unit area due to its lower temperature. This makes it appear less luminous despite being one of the largest known stars. For all its massive size, Betelgeuse has been relatively stable, until recently. Despite being a pulsating giant, it has shifted from a calm state to a more unstable one, which is, to put it mildly, alarming. This growing instability is a sign of a major transformation occurring inside Betelgeuse. The star's gas shell is burning, and it is gradually running out of hydrogen in its core. This is the site where the nuclear fusion process converts hydrogen into helium, a fundamental characteristic of a red supergiant. As hydrogen fusion in the core slows down, the outer layers of the star expand, causing it to grow even larger in size. During this phase, helium accumulates around the core, which is now mostly hydrogen depleted, and a new fusion process begins. This process, known as helium envelope burning, involves the fusion of helium atoms to form heavier elements such as oxygen and carbon. This reaction releases energy that combats the gravitational force trying to compress the star's outer shells. However, the burning of helium is not as constant as the fusion of hydrogen in the nucleus. This irregularity leads to accumulations of energy that are released sporadically. These bursts of energy destabilize the star's structure, causing its outer layers to expand and contract, which we perceive as pulsations that alter Betelgeuse's brightness over time. These pulsations release enormous amounts of energy and generate strong stellar winds. These winds are so intense that they tear large amounts of mass from the outer layers of the star, a phenomenon characteristic of red supergiants like Betelgeuse. 
These stellar winds not only cause the star to lose mass, but they also alter the internal distribution of matter and energy, further influencing the star's evolution. As the outer layers of the star expand as it grows and contract as it shrinks, a constant pulse is generated. We perceive this rhythmic activity as changes in its brightness, similar to the beating of a heart. To better understand these phenomena, astronomers employ a variety of methods. Among the most important are photometry and spectroscopy. Photometry measures the amount of light emitted by the star at different times, allowing us to observe changes in its brightness, as is the case with Betelgeuse, whose pulsations give us valuable clues about what is happening inside it. This method provides a direct connection with the behavior of the star, facilitating the ongoing monitoring of its luminous variations. On the other hand, spectroscopy analyzes the star's light at different wavelengths, revealing key details about its temperature, motion, and internal processes. When Betelgeuse pulsates, its spectral lines shift, allowing scientists to learn more about the physical mechanisms behind these pulsations. Together, photometry and spectroscopy allow scientists to build a complete picture of stellar behavior. By combining information from brightness analysis with spectral data, researchers can map out the internal structure of Betelgeuse and track its evolution over time. Astrophysicists go even further by using powerful computers to create highly detailed models that simulate the inner workings of the star. From the fundamental equations that govern its structure to the complex nuclear and fluid dynamics at its core, these simulations offer a predictive view into how Betelgeuse's pulsations might change as internal conditions vary. This effort connects theoretical models with observed data, bridging the gap between abstract science and tangible cosmic behavior. A particularly fascinating process occurring inside stars like Betelgeuse is stellar convection. In this process, energy generated in the core moves toward the surface, helping to balance internal processes with the star's external brightness. As hot matter in the core rises and cooler matter descends, convection currents form, transporting energy to the outer layers. This movement of matter alters the star's luminosity, making it appear brighter when more energy reaches the surface. These changes in energy flow, caused by convection currents, are responsible for the variations in brightness that we observe as pulsations. The amount of energy moving within the star fluctuates significantly, which explains the periodic alterations in its luminosity. Additionally, these pulsations are not merely random fluctuations. In fact, they can follow regular patterns, particularly in stars like Betelgeuse, which are classified as variable stars. The cycles of brightness are linked to the rhythmic expansion and contraction of the star's outer layers. As the star expands, the surface cools and dims, while during contraction the surface heats up and brightens. This process is the result of complex interactions between two fundamental forces, gravity and radiation pressure. Gravity pulls the star's matter inward, while the pressure from radiation, generated in the star's core, pushes outward. These opposing forces create a delicate balance, leading to the star's periodic expansion and contraction over time. This 